Hello, so today I have a haul from Pink. I actually didn't pick up any Victoria's Secret mists. I only picked up the ones from Pink, and I didn't pick up all of them. They seem to have been releasing a lot of scents lately. So I just went through and I looked at the scent notes. I only picked up ones that I thought that I would like because I didn't want to buy things I don't want. Um, I did get doubles on just two of them because I had to get to a certain amount to be able to use my coupon. So let's go ahead and start with the first one. This is their Pop Jelly Collection. This is like a throwback to Y2K. And you just see all the glitter like it's not glittery like the spray is not glittery it's just the glitter packaging it's absolutely adorable i love it so this is vanilla and dreamy which has sweet pear pink jasmine and bubblegum pop i'm gonna smell these on camera okay air out a little bit Okay, it, it does. Oh my gosh. Okay, so Leah Janae talked about this one, about how this one smells like wrapped in vanilla. And it does. Like, why does it smell like wrapped in vanilla? I mean, that's great because wrapped in vanilla smells amazing, but like with the scent notes, you would think that it would smell like fruity and juicy. It's sweet pear, pink jasmine, and bubblegum pop. Like, why does it smell like wrapped in vanilla? So if you didn't get a chance to smell wrapped in vanilla or if you didn't, get a backup of it, definitely try this out and see if you feel the same way. I heard her say that and I was like, no way. But yeah, it really does. She wasn't lying. That's crazy. I have some again. It's so weird. That's so strange. Okay. Throwing me for a loop here, pink. Okay. So the next one I picked up, this is the Warm and Cozy. This has sit notes of cotton candy, fluffy vanilla, and strawberry gloss. Spray this one. This is the one that I thought that I would like the most because it just sounds like something I would really like. And I really like it. It's sweet. Oh, it's really good. Definitely smell that strawberry in there. It's not super sweet like cotton candy sweet like I thought it would be, but you can definitely smell the strawberry and like a little bit of the sweetness. It's nice. I really like it. I'm going to enjoy wearing this one. Definitely a good, nice summer, spring scent. Okay, so I got two of those. So the next one in the Pop Jelly collection, I got Fresh and Clean. This is Guava Splash, Candy Apple, and Shimmer Velour. So I only got one of these. Okay. Just let it air out a little bit. Oh, I definitely get that apple. The sweet, sweet apple, that candy apple. Oh, it's nice. I like it. I don't like it enough that I would have got two, so I'm glad I only got one. But I do like it. I can really smell that candy apple in here. It smells like fresh and clean. <laughs> Imagine that. Okay. So the next one that I got, this is Vanilla and Dreamy. This is Fluffy Vanilla, Golden Caramel, and Coconut Cloud. This one's been out for a little while. a little bit oh it's not as sweet as I thought it would be I was expecting like coconut cream pie vibes it smells good though smell that coconut in there it's nice it's like Kind of just a coconut vanilla. It's not super sweet, though. I thought it would be sweeter. It's a nice scent, though. But I'm glad I only got one. So the next one I picked up, this is Sunset Gelato. A lot of people are saying this smells like Shirosa 62. This has pistachio gelato, caramel drizzle, and sea salt. So let's try this one out. A little bit. Oh, it does. It does smell like short <laughs> 62. Not exactly, but really, really close. It's nice. I mean, I like I like Shiro's 62. So if you like Shiro's 62, you'd probably like that one too. It's a little more salty though. That sea salt in there. So the next one I picked up. This is Candy Hearts. This is raspberry macaron. 
sugar praline and silk PJs. Bottle's cute. It's like frosted. All right. Sprayer on that one doesn't work very well. Oh, this smells familiar to me. Not like a body mist either. This smells like Ariana Grande. Ariana Grande's Thank You Next. It has that pickle smell to it. Oh my god. <laughs> wow. Okay. I wonder what that is. That's so weird. It truly really does. It smells like Thank You Next. I get that same vibe. Wow. Weird. Okay. <laughs> I didn't expect it to smell like that. I can't get over it. Okay. Maybe it'll dry down without the pickles. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to try that one on my skin. Okay. It's smelling a little bit better now. But I still get that pickle vibe. It definitely smells like Thank You Next. And not the 2.0. Not the really good one. <laughs> okay. So this is last one I have. This is Fresh and Clean. Sweet apple, fresh tangerine, and sea spray. All right. Definitely get that sea spray in the tangerine. Yep, definitely get the sea spray in the tangerine. I only smell the apple. Doesn't smell sweet to me. It's very like salty, orangey. It's a nice scent. Not my favorite scent. Like I'm glad I only have one of them. But I can wear this in the summer. Easy wear. So that is everything that I picked up from Pink. I just saw that they released a whole bunch of new stuff on the Victoria's Secret side. So I did place an order for that. I didn't get a bunch of them though because a lot of them I just... A lot of Victoria's Secret fragrances I don't like. Like, they just, they put too much floral in there, or there's just, I don't know. They're just not for me, most of them. I'm very much like a gourmand, fruity girl. And a lot of theirs are florals and sands and stuff like that. Like, stuff that I don't really like. So, I, I got a few. I'll have those coming maybe next week. I'm not sure. But let me know. Have you tried any of these? What are your thoughts on them? Thanks for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Bye!